Hi folks, I'm Crazy Normalcy and this is your Daily Beat. Let's start this show off with some Dragon Ball Xenoverse tunings. So yesterday, the extra pack 3 was shown off with new characters, Baby Vegeta and Kefla. Yeah, so there's that. Y'all got that game, y'all play that game, hop on that. Let me jump jump off that real quick. Dragon Ball Fighters. So, you know, we got we got base Goku and base Vegeta. Cool. I seen his gameplay. It's cool, better than I thought. But you know, it's like I'm not interested in that. I'm not interested in base Goku and base Vegeta. I mean I kinda expected that they were coming, but I you know, it's like, no, man, give me something better. So, I kind of lost interest into the game. If they would have had at least Baby Vegeta or even Majin Vegeta, you know, I would have been like, okay, yeah, those are other iterations on Vegeta. But, you know, it's like, okay, cool. I'll get, I'll get down with that. Base Vegeta is like, you know, of course, I'm saying all this stuff from an outsider's perspective because I haven't downloaded Base Goku or base Vegeta. So, you know what? Let me know your thoughts on that and down in the comments. Next up, let's talk about some Naruto to Baruto Shinobi Strikers. So, if you pre order at Best Buy, you get an exclusive pair of Shinobi Striker socks. Yeah, you heard that right. Socks. So, if socks are your thing, like, hey, Best Buy got you, got you covered. And on the PC side of things, hey, you get an optimized in the game to your own experience. Uh, you get the, you know, frame rates, the anti-aliasing, you know, stuff of that sort. And you also get a pre-order for exclusive Naruto 7th Coco game. I think I pronounced that right. If not, you're correct. Me. And early access to pain and Shinobi Striker Coats. I guess that's some in-game type stuff. So yeah, hop on that. So let's talk about Shingiro Miyamoto for a sec. He recently made some comments at the Computer Entertainment Developers Conference. Yeah, so he said something along the lines like developers should release games at a reasonable price instead of free to play. Now, you could ask yourself, what does this have to do with fighting games? So Brahala is making his way to Switch. It's a free to play fighter. So, this kind of, to me, if my game were coming to Switch, it, you know, it'd be kind of like a red flag. An alarm would go off in my head. So, you know, hopefully Brahala does good on Switch. You know, we'll see how that goes. But yeah, these comments were very interesting. And I guess it's just bad timing that it happened. Or I don't know. But, you know. It's very interesting. So Tekken 7, Season 2, is just a right, right around the corner. You know, let's take a look at a trailer just released for the Wabon system.
so yeah, the rest of that trailer showing other characters doing the with the wall bond system. So if you're into that, go look that trailer up. But if not, yo, let me know what kind of stuff you'd like me to cover down in the comments. For all things fighting games, you know where it's at. I'm crazy normalcy. Till next time, keep on fighting.